What is going on everyone? Leon checking in and today we're at it again with another video. So today we're going to talk about the Lamacall Gooseneck Tablet Mount Stand. Now this device comes in either gray or black. I have the black variation as indicated on the arm here. Now this tablet mount has some really nice features incorporated into it. So let's go ahead and get into it. First, we have the adjustable clamp. The clamp has grip groove pads and it will mount to any surface with a maximum thickness of two and three quarter inches. So I'm gonna go ahead and unscrew this so we can demonstrate how it works. So what we'll do is we'll pull up the upper part of the mount and then we'll slide the mount onto the surface and drop the upper part down. And then we'll screw down the plastic cylinder here. And we wanna tighten this down pretty good so that the mount isn't going to slide around. Now you can see that's gonna be on there securely. This doesn't move around easy either. So this actually mounts really good. Next we have the head. The head will also rotate 360 degrees. The head also has extended side arms to accommodate larger devices. To aid in extending those side arms, there are also ropes installed on them, so it makes pulling out the arms easier. Then we have the actual arms on the device. We have the forearm, which is the white portion, and then we have the rear arm, which is the black portion. These added functions give unlimited viewing angles for different mountain scenarios. Okay, so final thoughts. This stand is easy to set up and easy to use. I really like devices like this because they promote standing up and improve posture. Now there's a hidden feature here. You can also use this stand as a camera mount for your smartphone. Now there are some important things to remember. First, if we're going to use a larger device like a tablet, we have to remember that these devices are a little bit heavier. So we're going to have to include a few extra bends in the arms. Also, when we're using a larger device like a tablet, they're also going to be heavier, so the arm will tend to wobble a little bit. It's not horrible, but it is a little bit of a problem if you're trying to tap on the screen. The other thing to remember is that when it wobbles with a heavier device, you may have to adjust the arm a little bit to get it at a better angle, maybe include another extra bend. You're going to have to experiment here a little bit. But overall, I really like how this works. So that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it and found it useful, please leave a like. If you have any questions or comments, as always, drop those down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Now, there are three ways to support the channel. The first way is to click on the Amazon storefront link in the description below. There you'll find items that I have bought or I would like to buy and anything that you do buy from the storefront does support the channel. The next way to support the channel is just by sharing this video with someone who might enjoy it or find it useful. And the last way to support the channel is just by clicking that subscribe button. Now, now, liking and subscribing are important. Those are your ways to vote on whether you like the video or the channel. Liking and subscribing are also important for new viewers. If new viewers see likes and subscribers, they'll think that the videos are helpful and the channel is worth watching. So that is pretty much it. And until next time, Leon, check in out.